Hey everybody, it's Lori from Knox Fountain Farm. Welcome to another Crafty Saturday video. I am going to be going into the studio in just a minute and uh, filming the girls to see what they're up to. But I wanted to also uh, take a little walk around the shop and let those that have not been here see what we have, um, see some of the models, and uh, just take a little, you know, tour. I also wanted to give a plug to uh, Punch Needle and Primitive Stitcher Magazine. This is the recent issue. It is the 2019 summer issue. Um, I happen to be in this issue. I have my project is this little basket cross stitch. And there I am. See me? I'm down there. So if you haven't uh, already gotten your issue, you need to go out and get it. It's wonderful. It's a fabulous issue. I'm always honored to be in any of the publications. This one is a uh, very special one because it includes so many of my friends as designers. And um, the quality of the magazine is just spot on. It's excellent. So, uh, yeah, subscribe. Punch Needle. I, I guess you can go to pnpsmagazine.com or let's actually... PNPSmagazine.com. Okay, I'm going to head into the studio. Hey, Miss Joni. Hi, Laura. What you got? Well, a little show and tell. Some needle books I made. Very cute. They open up. It's got a little pocket as a wing. A little wing pocket. You put something in there. Needles or something. Needles or snippets or something, something. Okay. So they look like they're brothers from another mother right there. Well, they could be. Because they're kind of but, opposite but matching. Yeah. Yeah. That's my show and tell for today. That's all she's got for today, except she's working still on Teresa Kovitz. Yes, I'll be working on that for quite a while. She said in one of her videos that would be the rest of your life. Or was so. that your hook drop? <laughs> Everything. One of the one of the many works in Prague right yes, over there. It. Can you just pick up your red metallic mortar and show us sure. that thing? Let me get this off. So it's a um, it's a metallic board that is uh, used to hold your I guess you can patterns. use it to hold anything really um, your patterns. Joan can't figure out the stand. <laughs> <laughs> that was cute. 
Um, there's a stand that it sits on. Yeah. Whoops, there goes our okay. pattern. And then you, these are all little magnets. Yeah. So you can put your chart. Your well, that didn't work for you either, but we're not going to take that out. Just throw all them damn magnets up on that thing. <laughs> um, I know the name of the girls that we got this from, but you know, knowing me, it's not right at the forefront of my brain at this second. But I will put the information uh, for those beautiful boards. On, That's uh, very useful. On the, is that it? That's it for me today. Okay. Well, thank you. Thank you. Huh? <laughs> I'm not going to do that. Do it. Do it for us. <laughs> I'll be seeing you, Joni. <laughs> Crazy. Well, hi, Nance. Hello. How are you today? I'm good, other than being an extremely warm day today. Extremely warm. We're comfy in the shop. I know. We have brought another, we got Mr. Jack here with us. So yes. I'll take a picture of him snoozing her again. Yeah, Our, her, her little corgi boyfriend is with us, so... You are working. Well, you got all kinds of stuff. I got all kinds of stuff. So going you can on just today. do what you want. Alrighty. Well, this is. I've got two projects going on right now. This is sunflower jar from Grab Apple Hill Studio. With yeah. My favorite. Um, Isn't that beautiful? The crayons, crayon embroidery. She's got um, it on a, a really delicate, dainty print. Is it yeah, almost well, like a um, a leaf? Yeah, it's like a little little teeny tiny leaf in there. It's sort of the same colors. As, kind of brings it's it out. perfect. So Looks, it really works well with that. Yeah, just very vintage linen. So working on that, and then I'm working on a couple of glory. Oh, I'm working on this is horse on a hill, right? That's horse on a hill. Horse on a hill, and I'm trying my hand at doing the sandwich. Oh, the punch, uh, punch needle fusion. Fusion. Yes, nice. Fusion. Well, you can call it sandwiches. Sandwich. I like that idea. Oh, on, that's pretty. I'm what doing my. Look how fast she is. She's so fast. For you instead viewers doing, that are just watching this, she just literally put this on her hoop and already. Instead has. of just um, doing the polka dot, of course, that the pattern is, I'm doing my penny. Yeah. My um, mare mm -hmm. on the hill. So you're actually fashioning the pattern of his. Right. Her. Uh, Making her copper color coat. With, her, with her big white face. She's. She has I a see that. Big white face. Sweet. Now you're not going to do the entire background of that. No, because so, I have my, my right. fabric to be mm -hmm. that background, sort of sort of a sky bluish. Yep. yep. And then there's the flowers and such. And you so, said you're going to do those in a purple. In purple, because so that's Penny's colors. That's Penny's colors. And speaking of my horses, yeah. I finished this one. This is Folk Horse by Lori. Um, made it into my Frisian Froma. And if you can see the. Lines I put for her mane. I'm gonna bring the camera a little bit closer. I did some gray in there to show like the flowing of her mane because Frisians have long black manes. That's beautiful. And I love the way the I just used one Eldani. I wish I knew the number of it, but um, for the background, I didn't have to do any other colors. It just turned out really cool. Yeah, and that's yeah. just regular um, punch needle. It's punch not needle, the fusion, so she did She's just on the weaver's right. cloth. Right. Yeah. So love the colors. Finish that, and then I have. Three cross stitches that I finished. I bring out in summer. Um, some of them I finished a few years ago, and some of them I finished just last year. But yeah, that's this summer is field. Summer field. Yeah, I love that little lamb it's that a I did. Sweet little mat. Yeah, I love the finish. Show the edge of that. Just use that. So um, it's just is it uh, uh, whip stitched on? Whip stitched on. And you use the sari ribbon, the sari ribbon, silk I ribbon. Think of the name. Uh huh. Uh huh. I love that finish. It's, it's very dainty. By a candle. Almost like a. Um, Reminds me so much of summer. Yeah. And well, the sunflowers that are starting to bloom. I know. I know. And then I have. What is this? Plant? That one's called Plant Ye Seeds. Plant Seeds. Yep. That was an older pattern of mine. This one I did a while ago. Filled it with sawdust. Nice. Oh, Just I like the little, fabric in the back. A little crunchy. Yeah. It's really pretty. Of course. It has crows on it. I love crows. Very I nice. Bring them out in the summer. There's lots of crow ladies. That. Lots of crow ladies here today. And last but not least is the big honking of, tomatoes. Yes. Yeah, that one is tomato. Yeah. Have and instead of finishing the whole thing, I just decided to make the tomato the focal point with this little crow on Yeah, top. yeah. Very nice. Like the frame. Did you paint it? No. No? Just got it that way and just did a little bit of oh, sandpaper. There you go. Roughed it up a little bit and well, it sits awesome. on a shelf with a crow. That's nice. Uh -huh. I like the way that you did, uh, you took the motifs from the other parts of the mm -hmm. sampler and mm -hmm. like the little blossom and yeah, just hung them down the bottom. Yep. See, it's so good to see other people's ways that they do things. It's fun. Because, I mean, if you don't want to do an entire design, you don't have to do it. Well, it's getting rather large. <laughs> Maybe yeah, because it's, it's big, like... It's a big honking. Yeah, it's huge. It's huge. 
All right. Well, is that all you got for That's us today? That's all I got for you today, other than my jacket. You're so serious. Thank you, Miss Nance. You're welcome. Hey, Miss Anita. Hey, Lori. How are you doing today? Great. Finally got the uh, video camera back to par, so. Well, that's yeah. great. What are you doing? What are you bringing? What are you working on? I am working on something that I drew up myself. Um, a bucket, agate bucket with, um, I'm calling them Black Eyed Susans mm -hmm. uh, out of it. Mm -hmm. uh, I had trouble with the petals. I was trying to do the satin stitch. Right. And I didn't like it, so I took them out, and I, I'm liking the split stitch a whole lot better. Yeah, they look fuller, although I didn't mind the other ones either, so. I, I just didn't like it. Yeah, well, that's when you can do that, when it's, you know, there are no rules. Mm -hmm. Do what you gotta do. Make yourself happy. Yeah. Now, what are you gonna do that when you're finished with it? You still don't know. I don't know yet. Yeah. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. All right. I just wanted to do it, and it'll come to me later yeah. how I'm gonna, how I'm gonna finish it. Oh, yeah. What did and you bring for show and tell? Show and tell, uh, this is my 1803, 1830. Oh, yeah. Uh, rooster. Yeah. You were uh, working on that, I think, in a previous mm -hmm. video. Yeah. yeah. I so love it. I mounted it on a little board. It's perfect for that. To hang. Yeah. Finish that up. Didn't have to do the background of it either. Just no, left that. No, I love it. Yeah. Uh, a lot like easier. Nancy's doing the horse. You got I, other punch needles. Yes, I've just got a couple of little things that I've done over the years and this was a pin cushion that I did punch needle. This was kind of the first punch needle that I did. I love it. Um, I did the snowman and Santa Claus yep. with little pillows. Very cute. And I also did a stocking. Very cute. Uh, to hang. Cute ornament for the yeah, tree. Yeah, definitely. And Very the other cute. little pillows, you can make a I, ornament out I of them. I actually or... put these on the tree, bury them up in the... Oh, just sit them know, on? The, mm, yeah, yeah, the, okay. The limbs. Nice. But um, they, uh, I've done these years ago. So. Oh, I love them. Yeah, but I, I like this them. too. I know, that's adorable. I, I'm hoping that you're going to make some of those for the shop. I just might. I think you should. If you, you should. are a good girl, <gasps> I might. I try to be. Uh, questionable. Oh, you hear this? You hear this, my my viewers? How would they? Last uh, weekend you told them all to come here because it was just wonderful. Now it's it questionable. It is wonderful to come here. <laughs> it is. Hello, Miss Janice. Well, hello. What are you doing? I'm sanding some cardboard that Peter gave me. Oh, to do for my snippet thread catcher. Yes, they are. You saw them last sisters. week. Of course, the other sister had to have the biggest. That's right. So that's she what likes she big did. things. That's oh, big girls have big snippets. <laughs> I'm Depends not even going there. You want to I'm snip. not going there. So you didn't bring any show and tell again, but you will next week. Y yes. Yes, I will. You had that last week. You cannot do the same show and tell two t two well, days in a row. Two times in a row. Yes, I'll have some. All right. We still love you though. Okay. Right. So, but I'll you'll still be here. Me. We're good then. Um, I'll come back and show you guys what I'm working on in a second. Here's our favorite little boyfriend that comes to visit us, Mr. Jack. Hey, you. There he is. He's got that smile. He's looking at his mommy. Gorgeous smile. Yeah. Here's my witch I'm working on that I showed you guys the other day. You know how And uh, the girls are just amazed at the way that the Valdani, um, we're using, I'm using the Valdani number eight pearl cotton. It's variegated and it is doubled in my needle. Pretty, isn't it? Mm -hmm. But the way that um, I'm stitching, of course, I try to stay with the contour. But for some reason, it just it comes up in a way that makes it look plain like that. So just keep practicing. The more you do, the better you get, and the more fun you have doing it. So, all right, that is it, my sisters. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye, Miss Nancy Goodbye, and Jack. Jackson. Goodbye, Miss Joni. See you next week. Good Lord's willing and it freaks don't rise.